Ken from SRKCycles.com. We have a 2001 Honda RC51. This bike is a beast. Anyone who knows anything about racing and, and motorcycles and Honda, they know the RC51 is a great track bike. This bike was built for uh, kind of to try out the whole V-twin thing because Ducati was doing pretty good in the races back then. And uh, who was it? Nicky Hayden. Nicky Hayden was the man that rode this thing. These things are sick. A lot of fun to ride. This particular bike has 18,000 miles on it. And um, you see a lot of these things still on track days. Even though they're a little older, you can get them cheap. This one, you can get it dirt cheap because it has an R title. Now I'm going to ride the bike. I'm going to show that it runs straight. Um, but I, this is the only R title bike I've ever had. And uh, it really is going to be dirt cheap. You're looking at like 2,300 bucks, which is which is a great deal for a track bike. It doesn't make sense to pay to spend 5,000 bucks for a track bike that you're not going to ride on the road anymore. You know what I mean? So you might as well buy uh, my track bike has a salvage title. But the cool thing about this is it still has factory body, and it's still street legal, so you can ride it on the street. But it also has a if you were going to track it, the lights and the factory body and stuff like that, you can sell all that stuff online and get a lot of your money back for it. Nice feeling V-twin. I should have adjusted the slack out of the throttle. Out of the throttle. Now the purpose of me doing these test drive videos is not to show anybody how fast I can go or how long I can wheelie, but just to uh, show people how the bike runs. A lot of my customers buy uh, in the Dodge Butterflies. A lot of my customers are out of state and uh, they buy their bike sight unseen. So I just want to show them that hey, this is, a, this is a good running bike. It shifts through all the gears no problem, it's not making any goofy noises. This, of course, is a six-speed. All sport bikes are six-speeds. And it does have that cool-looking uh, digital tachometer. It really does have a lot of good low-end low -end grunt. This bike is still a very relevant, no, re relevant, I don't know what I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say is, this is still a great track bike. You could buy this thing, have a lot of fun. It's still a great street bike, actually. It's still a great bike. Um, oh, shoot. I forgot it's all. A lot of stones. Big washout. So normally you can be in a like third gear pulling out of a corner real slow and still grunt your way out of the gear. You know what I mean? Normally on a stock geared bike, on a stock uh, inline four, you know, you gotta be in second or something. And for being an older bike, the older Hondas don't, unlike the Suzuki's and stuff like that, and the Kawasaki's, the way they look, the older Hondas don't feel like big, bulky, Doppler bikes. And this thing feels pretty decent. Check out the check out the walk around video on this. I don't I don't know why it's why it was our title. Uh, it's possible it's possible that it was a uh, fast recovery. 
Uh, we'll get a little closer on the walk around video just to figure out why that might be. Maybe we can see some scratches or something like that. Um, from what I saw, it actually looked pretty clean. Up here, we'll take a left and we'll we'll get on it a little bit. This thing has like a giant seat. It's got a little pad on the back of the seat, but I gotta move my butt like I feel like it's like 12 inches just to hit it. Transmission shifts flawlessly. The only thing that's driving me nuts is the slack and the throttle, but that could be. But that could be uh, just adjusted out. And this bike's in great, pretty great shape. guys this wraps up the video for the rc51 2001 honda i do ship bikes all over the country i've had about seven bikes get shipped out just in the past two weeks uh, we're moving about 30 plus bikes a month now feeling uh we're bursting out of the seams at our uh, at our overflow location and uh we're having a lot of fun doing it all right guys this is sean signing out Remember, it's not what you're riding, but where are you going? I'll see you guys later.